And now up to bat, KCAL Online's Joy Benedict. Yeah, she continues our team coverage tonight with reaction from fans. Oh, say can you see? It was a lineup of legends in celebration of America's favorite pastime. As Dodger Stadium played host to Major League Baseball's All Star Game. It's the first time the All Star Game's in LA in like 40 something years, so we had to show up. And although Dodger fans lined every section, Dodgers, baby, all day. The sea of jerseys seemed to come from every city. I'm a Padres fan. Yankee, baby, all the way. And that is what makes this game so unique. The best of the best on the field and the fans who love them in the stands. I already saw Jake Cronenworth. That was that was top of the list. Manny Machado. I'm hoping to see him running around here. The gates opened four hours early and fans lined up for the team shop for food to get photos to remember. I bought tickets for my dad. He's never been to one. Definitely on the bucket list. A tradition for some and a once in a lifetime moment for others, all in the name of baseball. I think it's really special because when you come here to the stadium, everyone has different team jerseys on. And it's the one time you can be a Yankees fan in Dodger Stadium. stadium. Oh, yeah, and not have to worry about anything. At the end of the day, we're all coming together for baseball, which is great for the game. It is the first time in 40 years this city has hosted the All Star game, something locals aren't taking for granted. It's so great to have LA back in the limelight, including yeah. baseball, football, hockey. It's it's the place to be. Proving the city of Angels may be the biggest all-star of them all. Go, go Dodgers! Dodgers! Woo! Go. LA, baby! Of course, this game was supposed to take place back in 2020, but was rescheduled because of the pandemic. Next year, the all-star festivities move to Seattle. From Dodger Stadium, I'm Joy Benedict, KCAL 9 News. Well, people 